The first question I have for you though is, how many of you have to deal with these tough, high stakes, sometimes risky conversations? Quick show of hands. You know what? We all deal with them all the time. Three crucial points I want to make to you today. I'm going to reinforce these several times. The first one is that behaviour matters for all of us. Some behaviours are more important than others. We call these the vital few. The vital few, not the trivial many, but the vital few. And very importantly, we're constantly influencing one another through our behaviour and our communication. Now, how many amongst you have been asked to do the impossible? In recent times, what you, you believe to be impossible, you believe to be extremely challenging, very difficult. Come on, show of hands. Who's with you? Look, look at those numbers. See? Okay, so let's watch. We're going to set the scene with this first video. Here we go. This is the context for what's going on. Well, your team has had over a week to come up with a plan. How long will it take to bring the project in? It'll take us just over six months. Six months and a week, to be precise. Is that what you were thinking? <laughs> well, I know this is a stretch, but I was thinking by the end of the quarter. Well, it's a good thing we're talking about it now before any commitments have been made because there's no way to finish that soon. It's always taken us almost twice that long. So a crucial conversation is one where the stakes are high. What's at stake here with Rick and Brittany? Their jobs, their careers, product delivery, customer satisfaction, um, uh, organisational value, and the list goes on. Yes? Never mind the flow-on effects. In this case, there's an opposing opinion, isn't there? What's the opposition here? What's the difference of view? Quick. You can do it, you can't do it. You can do it, you can't do it. How, how quickly does Rick need it to be done? Because he's made a commitment to the execs. How quick? End of quarter three. And guess what? It's, it's start of quarter three? I don't know, Louise. It could be in the middle of quarter three. <laughs> okay, so we don't know. Let's give benefit of the doubt. It's the start of quarter three. Brittany, who's done this how many times? Lots before. Says how long does it take? It's not just six months blind, it's six months and a week. This woman knows what she's talking about. Okay? So not only are they disagreeing about the time and what can and can't be done, let me suggest to you they're disagreeing about how they're working together. Rick is making decisions without her input, making ridiculous commitments to executives without her input, and then coming and telling her what has got to be done. Folks, we're going to start now with this quick interaction. One minute, I'll speak this very fast and furious. One minute, talk to your colleagues. What's going wrong here? Where's the problem? What's the issue? One minute. So what's the problem? What, what's the issue here with these folks? What about it though? We said communication. What about communication? What's the problem? <laughs> there was none was suggested. I would suggest to you there was a huge amount of communication. <laughs> Another session we hope to be able to run for you is on how you can personally and in terms of your leadership of your family and your workplaces, regardless of your title and role, how you can increase your influence tenfold.